y'all, it's the Cincy Lady of East Texas. So I just wanna share a couple of things that have been on my heart and on my mind for the last couple of days. So I know that we are all in the middle of a forced quarantine situation right now, but that doesn't mean that our businesses have to stop. It means that we have to put our thinking caps on and get creative with ways to share our businesses, share our products, and give people the hope and the happiness that we all know that Cincy provides them with our products. So how can you do that, right? Well, you can keep posting, for one. People are tired of scrolling through social media and seeing news and numbers and new announcements from this and that closing and this and that closing and however many more people got diagnosed. If nothing else, if you're posting that you are wiping down your countertop with CounterClean or washing your dishes with the new Johnny Appleseed dish soap, it brings people joy because it is something different on their newsfeed. I promise. If you are willing to make porch deliveries, hop on it offer those things. You're not interacting with people. You're literally getting in your car with somebody's order, driving to their house and dropping it on their porch. They can send payment to you through PayPal, Venmo, leave you some cash under the doormat, what have you. There are ways to keep going. But I think the number one thing that we need to focus on right now is offering people hope. Just offer them hope, offer them something happy. We all know that people love Scentsy. They are in their homes for an unknown amount of time, so they're still gonna have laundry, they're still gonna have messes to clean up, they're still gonna have kiddos at home, they're still gonna have stinky socks, so offer them fragrance. Fragrance is a mood enhancer. So if they know that they are gonna be at home for a while, then be sure and offer them a chance to stock up on their favorite six pack. Or offer the 10 bar special. Or offer mystery bags with some random cleaning products. Or offer the laundry love at a discounted rate. It doesn't matter what you do as long as you're doing it. Because I guarantee if you just halt your business during this unknown amount of time, it's gonna be hard for you to pick back up where you left off when things get back to normal. And they will, y'all. This is not doomsday. We are going to pick right back up where we left off, but you don't want people to go, oh, well you sold Scentsy during that time? I didn't realize it, so I've been buying it at Walmart or I've been buying it from Homegirl that's been posting like crazy about her business. You don't wanna give people a reason to go elsewhere, right? You want them to know you're still in business. You may not be posting things about selling, but you're still posting that you're using the product. You're staying in the forefront of their mind that you are still a Scentsy consultant. And when they need something or they're intrigued by your post, I guarantee they're gonna reach out to you. And do different types of things during this time. Play bingo with your customers. You never know what it's gonna lead to. It may lead to somebody thinking, well, she's having a blast with her business. I wanna join. This is a great time while I've got some downtime. I've got some time to work on focusing, launching a business. And you may have a recruit fall in your lap. You never know. But if you're not doing anything, if you just put your business on hold for an unknown amount of time, you're gonna have a hard time picking back up where you left off. So get creative, put your thinking cap on, and don't let this virus win. Because I promise, we're gonna pick right back up where we left off and you don't wanna miss any time. Y'all have a good one.